Nobody denies that low carb diets work. We all know that they do. But there are certain people for whom low carb diets work extremely well. Usually, uh, scientists explain that as being a matter of insulin sensitivity, but in this video I want to talk about insulin, insulin sensitivity compared to carb addiction. Okay, insulin sensitivity basically has to do with how your body responds to carbs or sugar. Okay, and uh, that is one of the reasons why some people eat a little bit of carbs and they'll be fine. Some people eat a little bit of carbs and their blood sugar levels will go crazy and they'll store more fat than another person. Okay, so that is certainly one of the reasons why low carb diets work uh, really well for some people because if you're very insulin sensitive and you take out the carbs, your insulin levels will stay level and you won't be storing fat. Now, the big deal for some other people, like me, in my opinion, is something called carb addiction, okay? It's something I basically just made up, but the idea is this, okay? It's not just a matter of how your body reacts to carbohydrates or sugar, although that's important. A very, very important part of why I think that some people respond much better to a low-carb diet is how their mind reacts to sugar, okay? I personally am a carb addict, okay? I could drink like one sip of wine, one sip of beer, put the glass down and I even finish. And as a matter of fact, if I have a cheat day and I do have a beer, a lot of times that happens. I'll drink like half a beer and then the next day the beer will still be sitting there because I'm not an alcoholic, okay? Try to give me one donut and tell me that I could st I have to stop after that, okay? It's not gonna happen, okay? So whether or not I'm insulin sensitive is less important than the fact that I am very highly carb and sugar addicted, okay? If I eat a tiny little bite of carbohydrates, I'll go out on a bender and you, know, you won't see me for five days. I mean, seriously, it gets really bad sometimes. So, that's like I said, a, one of the groups of people, regardless of the way their body handles sugar, one of the groups of people that are going to really benefit from a low carb diet are just people who can't stop, can't say no. People who for whatever reason have a, like a mental addiction to carbohydrates, okay? And like I said, there are people like me that we could stop eating carbohydrates and we could you know, eat protein and fat in moderation, but as soon as we start eating carbs, we really, really, really go overboard. We have a hard time staying on a diet. And that is just another group of people for whom low carb dieting gets excellent results.